Hey, how's it going, YouTube? This is Premier. For those of you who don't know me, um, I promised a bunch of people that I'd put some videos assault. on YouTube and commentate them. So here it goes. Anyways, it's an assault game on Tempest. Um, <laughs> we're playing a team of... It's like a clan tag, I guess. But anyways, I, I pushed their sniper off break, which uh, it's not doesn't end up well. Uh, and they're getting cleaned up by the Warthog that nobody uses but they use it so um, I'm not gonna be mad about it I'm just gonna respawn and just do a little something else cause I saw that kid pick sniper and I see he's going to the right side of our base maybe flank around maybe camp I don't really know so I'm gonna work to the left I'm not trying to get sniped here alright um I'm playing with none of my friends here I'm, only, I'm playing with my brother Pyro um and I have no call outs my teammate doesn't talk my teammates have no mics um and one of my teammates already quit as you just saw just as soon as I died Homeboy just shot the tree trying to rocket me and killed himself. Anyways, um, I'm pushing in the back of their base. I see that bomb's about to blow. It needs no help. Nobody's disarming it, so I just leave it alone. I shoot three really bad shots at these guys. I don't know if I thought I could shoot them to the windshield, but it doesn't matter. Kid dies. I spam. Goes black screen. Comes back. I know the weapons are up. So the first thing I'm going to do is go for that sniper since I'm so close. And I actually decided also to go for the rockets because none of our teammates are really in position to get rockets. And I don't want the other team to have them. Since I'm so close anyway, I just go ahead and pick them up. Alright, they on the bomb. We have really no aim position to do anything about it, so I just killed that guy. I don't know why I said I stopped the bomb because he armed it, but uh, very weird. Anyways, that bomb is too far gone. I see this kid on my radar. Take my time, shoot a nice rocket. <clears throat> if he would have had evade, he could have got out of the way. If that's why I always use evade. Evade can get us so many situations. It's insane. Evade is if you can ever pick evade, pick evade. Now what I'm doing here is I'm on the flank side of their base, the left side of each base has a cave, two different caves, and it's, it's literally a, a enormous flank. Like so, use those as your flanks. So you're trying to sneak around. All right, I see that guy with a jetpack, and I know that I have rockets and sniper, and rockets aren't going to really do much for a jetpack guy. You unless you hit him directly. And sniper, that's just a hard shot. I don't try to put myself in hard situations. Anyway, he tries to chase me down, and I get myself in a better situation than I previously had. That kid, I see him run through the cave. I think about going after him. Maybe if he pushes back out, he's going to get rocketed, but he never does. I'll leave him alone. But I know he's pushing the side, and I have teammates over here. <clears throat> so I end up killing the guy I was looking at, and then killing another guy. Rock Stranger, I look for a DMR, get it quick, and I go in to push the bomb with my teammate to make sure he doesn't have any problem getting this. I don't think he will, they were too dead. This guy's here, I'm missing no scope, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Because the only, he's like not a problem. The bomb's armed. If he's not disarming it, there's no need for me to go for him. That kid, I leave him alone, because I knew the bomb's too far gone. He was. He committed suicide basically. This guy's retarded. Pre scope, easy shot. <clears throat> they're too dead again, at least. Um, I see the bombs on our side. I know they're about to arm because my brother told me, I believe. And uh, I told him just to keep pulling the bomb. Nope, my side. So I set up for him, and there ends up being three people on me. And. Uh, I thought this kid knew where I was at, he had no idea. This is LB down, finish him. Just must go in the face, I get betrayed um, by the Warthog. That's two deaths by a Warthog. One my own and one theirs. Anyways, don't try to get too mad, just spawn and keep pushing, even though it's really annoying. Cause that was a pretty good double. Anyways, they are on the bomb, that's the kid that my brother was talking about uh, a while ago. But I'm not worried about it. I, there's no way I can stop it. There's no way. So don't, I don't even look. I just keep pushing. I know that if we arm this bomb before they do, it's game. We're man down. you got to play aggressive when you're man down. It's, especially against a team who definitely has call outs. Um, I get the sniper. The bomb's right there. And uh, I know they're all over it. And I'm by myself. I see this kid on my radar. So I don't really want to push in there and start evading in there and just go Rambo style because it's not going to work. Like, that's putting myself Bomb in a bad situation. Set. I'm not camping here. Bomb I'm not being a take. faggot, whatever you want to call it. This is how you need to be playing. Like, you have no help. I'm not going to go in there and arm the bomb and kill everybody on their team. So I wait and play it smart, play it safe, kill this guy for rockets, and that basically wraps up the game, in my opinion. <laughs> 
full rockets. <clears throat> so I go back, wait in the cave for his teammates. Cave, so much cover. I won't invade them out of the way of anything. Even a rocket. They don't even have rockets. I have their rockets. But, um, just wait for my teammates, basically. They arm the bomb here. My brother says that he can disarm it. And if he can disarm it, then that's going to be game over. So I trust him when he says, fingers crossed. Sit around here waiting anxiously, looking for last second kill. Hoping that he gets his arm. He gets his arm. We get the plant. It's game over. Um, man down. Beating a clan. It's been Premiere. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks.